Yo, what is up guys? So this is gonna be a quick video, um, basically showing you guys how to uh, make your consoles more reliable without you know doing really hardly anything to them. And this is for RGH consoles, and RGH and JTAG consoles, of course. Um, you can do this with um, uh, Sidekick, I think it's called, the mod tool. Um, you can do it with that, or you could just do it in Dash Launch, which is pretty simple, but uh, I'm online right now, this is the newest dashboard, 17849, uh, it doesn't really matter, but just to show you guys that I'm online on that dashboard, um, if you guys need help setting it up, then go look at my other video, but uh, basically all we're doing is changing the fan speed, so um, we're going to go to XCX menu, then we're going to click RB, we're going to go to dash launch, installer, then default.xcx. <coughs> And we're gonna click RB and system info. We're gonna click that. Then we're gonna scroll down two times, or actually one, two, three, and then it's gonna go over here. Then you're gonna go, you're gonna go over right, and then I'm sure you can hear my fan speed getting louder. Um, for fat consoles, I would recommend that you keep your your fan speed at 100%. Um, if you guys are gonna be recording stuff, like for YouTube and stuff like I do, I mean, I would keep it lower, but as you can see at the top right of the screen, you got your CPU, your GPU, your RAM, and your motherboard. So um, when, it get, when your GPU gets pretty hot, like mine is right now, mine's at 60C, and you know, probably, Xenons and Zephyrs and Falcons, they're gonna get a lot higher than that. They're gonna get to like 69C and stuff like that. That's not good. And same for Slims, they're they're pretty, they're not that good either um, for heat, heat wise because Microsoft didn't make, they didn't put up a good fan in that console. So, um, you know, they overheat too. Slims get red dot just as much as a, a Falcon does. Um, the most reliable console you can buy is a Jasper, because they're the coolest, but um, for slim consoles, the lowest I would go is 70%, and then same thing for fats, I, would, I wouldn't go any lower than 70%, but um, uh, you know, if you guys don't want Red Ring of Death, then I would keep it at 100%, and you guys, that's, that's just going to keep your console, um, it's going to keep it cool and it's gonna keep the dust out. Um, you know, they're still gonna get dust in it, but it's gonna help um, a lot better. But see, say if you guys brought this fan speed way down here, like you can't even hear it. And then watch the temperature rise up. You know, I'm not, I'm not even gonna do that because it, I don't want my console to get screwed up, but um, you know, letting your temperature go way down or way up like that, to like 70C and stuff like that, that's gonna ruin your consoles quickly, and it's gonna read ring. So, you know, guys, uh, put that fan speed way up on up there, so you won't have read ring of death issues. And then save, and then you're good to go. So, yeah, guys, uh, tomorrow I'm gonna be making a um a video about or how to install the blue notifications so let me show you guys a blue notification real fast I'm sure you've seen one should connect me back in the Xbox Live but so if we invite him to a party you know you got that blue notification so tomorrow guys look be looking out for a video on how to install that on your RGH peace out guys have a good night